My name is Shirley Jones, and we're getting ready to get our training started. We have uh, Mr. John Rose here with us, and we need to give him our undivided attention. Um, he's very good, and he can show us more about the business. Thank you. Great, great. Um, how's everybody doing tonight? Great. Great. Well, I, what I want to do is, uh, first of all, give uh, Paul a hand for an excellent job that he did earlier. And Deidre, of course, as well as give her a hand. So, we're going to get started tonight with our training, and uh, I hope that you have pens and paper with you, because you never know when something that is being shared may, one nugget that will be shared that will take your business to that next level. So we want to, as she was saying, uh, give our undivided attention to what is being shared. If you're, we know we, we have people that are coming into the business, so if you're coming into the business, y'all go ahead and handle your business. <laughs> and we'll just go on. Um, what, one of the things that I realize is more, that's very important in the area of network marketing, and that is the, the power of a three-way call. How many have heard of the power of a three-way call? That's very important. And I'm going to share a little about that, but before I get to that, um, I have a little script for that, but before I get to that, how many of you have some goals for your business? How many have them written down? Look around you. Okay. It's important for us to have our goals written down. If there's a, a clause that says, if you fail to plan, you plan to what? Fail. 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 So you have to have your goals written down. And even in the um, church arena, it says write the vision and make it what? Plain. Plain. That people, um, that those who read it and, and hear it may run with the vision. But if it's not written down, you don't know what it is, then how can the people coming behind you, like myself coming behind Deja, how can I run with it? You know, so I got to have my goals. And one of the things I want you to encourage, each person in here is a leader, correct? Yeah. Every person is a leader. So every leader, every time you bring in a uh, rep, your goal should be to have them to determine their, and this is the first thing, their why. Everybody say why. Why? why. You have to have a why because, see, when those t there are times that are going to come when somebody may say no, and it's going to make you kind of feel like sink all down, <laughs> you know, <laughs> feeling bad like, oh, they, they didn't like my business, they didn't want to come into my opportunity. And somebody may come, oh, I heard about that stuff, I'm not interested, blah, blah, blah. You know, you've got to know what your why is because if your why is not strong enough, you'll be here one day and then go on the next. You'll be here one week, go on the next week, one month, then go on the next month. And so you got to determine what your why is. So what I want everybody to do in front of you, write down what your why is. What is your why? Why are you doing this business? So take just, just about a few seconds, about a minute. <laughs> to write down your why. So write down your why. And while you're writing that down, I, I do want to say also, let's give a hand for Shirley Jones for doing an excellent job of introducing me. How many of you finish with your why? Okay. Now, I'm going to put some of y'all on the spot, all right, who are not afraid to share their why. Now, it's so important to share your why because um, it may inspire someone, but at the, also, uh, at the same time, it reminds you of why you're doing this business. So who would be the first to volunteer? You have a great smile. <laughs> uh, okay. what, is, what is your why? Well, more money. I really would like to make more money. And I would like to better my life with my family, my grandbaby, and 
you know, just have a better life, you know, just do better, you know. That's, that's, that's great. A, that's, that's a great why, everybody. Mm -hmm. Did you hear that? One of the things that really, you know, stood out, she said more money, but she saw, said, also said to spend more time with her what? Family. Family, Family grandchildren. Mm -hmm. um, that is one of my whys, but I'm not going to go into mine. Anybody else? <laughs> Anybody else want to volunteer the why? Yeah, yes, go right ahead. Oh, oh, and what's your name? I'm sorry. Neil. 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 Okay, go right ahead. Uh, I would say why to make money. Mm -hmm. Why to get bills paid on. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. Why to, to be able to do what I want to do. Mm -hmm. All right. And that can be anything. anything. Mm -hmm. Travel. Mm -hmm. be, and my family, they live all over, so I can go over you know, wherever I want to go. Oh, buy me a new car. <laughs> 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 you know, um, I may want to leave Lexus and go somewhere else. Oh, yeah. no. Good yeah. Awesome. Come on, let's give our hand, everybody. Yeah. Did, you, did y'all hear that? To do whatever you want to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Did y'all hear that? To do whatever she wants. Right. You're not on the time clock to say, okay, or uh, you can't take a vacation this week. You got to work. Or, you know, you don't have enough money in the bank, so you can't travel to this state or that state or out of the country. You know, so the, that's a great why. Uh, one more person. Go ahead. Um, mine was financial freedom, but also to um, be able to donate and be able to help others. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Fin financial freedom to be able to donate mm -hmm. and to help others. Awesome. Awesome why you know, um, how many people, I mean, really think about that, you know, I'm getting paid or I'm getting blessed or getting commissions in order to give to others. Because, see, when you have that focus in mind and at the forefront, I guarantee you, you know, the master makes sure that you get yours. <laughs> Amen? Amen. Amen. All right. All right. Now, the second one we want to go down to is what level or income do you desire this month? So write it down. What level? What level? Other company, we know that first you have to get qualified. Then there is the senior director. There's a regional director, national director, international. So what level, what level do you want to make this month? I have in mind what I want to make this month, what level I want to make. Okay. Did you write that down. Did you say yes. And then write down the income you desire. Because, see, you can be at that level but not making an income. Right. Or you can be making a large amount of income and may not be at a certain level that you want to be at. So you want to kind of put the two together. So what type, what level you want to be at, and what income do you want to make? Do I have any volunteers? Any volunteers? Besides Paul. Oh, okay. <laughs> we know Paul want to make all the money, right? <laughs> right, okay. We be there with you, Paul. Okay. We're trying to get there. Okay, I'll understand. Okay. Besides Paul and Deacon. Okay. Anybody else? Come on. Any volunteers? Okay. Me again. All right. I'm having a problem getting people, like, dying on people, so I have to go down there. Oh, oh, yes, yes, reverse that. <laughs> uh, okay, what level do you want to be at? Well, I want to be at the, I guess, the next level. I don't know what <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> the next level. I want to, you know, have my... Senior director? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Notice how I phrased that. Notice you said, I'm having what? Oh, Trouble. Oh, right. Regardless of where you are, regardless, because all of us are going to have, and rephrase, change that word to challenges. Challenges. Mm -hmm. I may be having some challenges right now, just breaking through that to the next level. Doesn't that sound better? Yes. yes it does. Instead of you know, and I'm not <laughs> down there. I'm just saying because it's, what it, we're trying to do is change our mindset. Right. Um, as a millionaire, millionaires when they the way they think, they don't look at problems. Mm -hmm. They look at challenges. Okay, I got this challenge. Mm -hmm. How can I get to that next level? How can I solve? And that's why they become millionaires. Right. Because they right. look for a solution to whatever problem or challenge that they're having. Okay? 
So let's look at challenges. Okay, now we go, let's go back. So you want the question was, uh, what level do you want to get to? Oh. You okay. desire to get to. Yes, the next level. The next level, which is, mm -hmm. and see, Correct. you okay. What did you say? Well, the month of March. Right? That's for this month, right? Yes. Well, okay, yes. So, senior director. Senior director. Okay, yes. great. And see, we all need to know that what that next level is. If we say just the next level, mm -hmm. it could be another membership. Mm -hmm. That may be a next level, but not in terms of our, um, as the level of what the company says. Okay, so senior director. And then what, your in, oh, what type of income? <laughs> okay, but we want to be specific because see, when you hit it, then you know, hey, I reached that level. I set my goal and I made it. Now that I made my goal this month, I, huh? A thousand dollars. Come on, let's give it up. That's good, and that's doable. It really is doable. Senior director. And do we got how many more weeks left in this month? Almost two and a half weeks. So that's very doable. If you brought in three, and those three brought in three, you will make senior director. Am I right? Okay. All right. All right. Um, anybody else? Okay. Let's go on. Now, six months, what do you want to make? Write that down. In six months, what do you want to be making? In one year, what do you want to be making? And I'm kind of speed this up a little. Okay. And I said one year, right? Okay. So write down that particular, that deadline. At the end of this month, the 30th, uh, March the 30th, <coughs> six months from now, which would be what, March? April, May, June, July, August, September, is that right? Okay, by September the 30th, what do you want to be making? A year from now, March, um, what's today, 14th? March 14th, this time next year, what do you want to make, be making? And this is what I encourage everybody, regardless of what other, whatever type of challenges you have, to be here one year from today. Mm -hmm. Just be here one year mm -hmm. from today. You say, well, what about the other years? No, just start with one year. Mm -hmm. Be here one mm -hmm. year from today. Mm -hmm. you, your business can't do anything but to grow. Mm -hmm. Right, okay. okay. All right, now, let's go to number three. Who to call? Who to call? Who to call? You know, some people say, well, you know, I'm gonna call this person and I don't know who to call. Y'all, look at this thing right here. I guarantee y'all probably got about a hundred numbers in this cell phone. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, me alone, I, I think I got about maybe 400. If you start from the top and work through it, and this is actually, this particular analogy I got from a gentleman that was doing the training with Momentus. He said, start with your, you know, you carry, you carry this around everywhere you go. Start with the list on your phone. So, okay, so who to call? Start with the list on the cell phone. Two, I mean, uh, this is still three. Facebook. How many have a Facebook account? How many have more than 100 friends? Yeah. Start with it. There's people, um, maybe about three potential prospects, one that already came in that I've communicated with over, over Facebook. And they're in Washington. These are Washington, okay. D.C. Okay, so don't underestimate the power of social media. Mm -hmm. Get your Facebook account, start, start <laughs> making friends, community. You don't know who's hurting. You don't know who's in need. I talked to a lady today in Chicago. Now, this is God honest truth. This was right before I came here. And I, I called her, I, you know, when I do things, I try to do them, you know, kind of spirit-led. Spirit and I prayed, and I said, okay, who should I call, who I communicate? So I got on Facebook real quick. I said, I'm going to call this young lady. Her name is Phyllis. Long-time friend, live on the same block. We used to live in Chicago. And so I mentioned it to her, and I said, um, give me a call. 
by all means, don't start, how do I say, uh, this may sound gross, but don't get diarrhea at the mouth. <laughs> don't start, you know, telling them what you want to tell them about, blah, blah, blah. No, just say, give me a call. I did that. She called me like it, within five minutes. I was shocked and I missed the call. <laughs> I was like, oh my goodness, I missed it. So I called her back and then I said, oh, Phyllis, I, I just wanted to know if you would support, um, I'm trying to expand to sh Chicago, to Illinois. And I just want to know if you would support my business and be a customer. Notice I didn't ask her to join my business. Mm -hmm. I just said be a customer. Mm -hmm. And um, I asked her, what, well, what is the um, electric company there? And she told me, blah, blah, blah. After that, um, she said, well, I have to, you know, first talk it over with my husband. Now, this is very significant, y'all. I said, yeah, you definitely want to do that. Right before she hung up, I said, oh, and by the way, if you're interested also in making some money and, and getting paid on your electric bill, let me know. She said, guess what she said? Hmm. Well, you know, as a matter of fact, you know, I've been working for the postal system for almost 17 years, and because of my health condition, I'm going to have to come off of my job, mm -hmm. and I'm going to need something else. Mm -hmm. You see? So we don't know who is in need, right. who's going to be hurting, but that people are looking for something else, and they need something that's going to to help them to, um, how would you say, uh, not, is it compensate or is it accentuate the, 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 the finances, make up for what they're going to be missing later on. So anyway, that's just an a, a illustration of um, using social media and the question that you can ask. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I always get that word wrong. <laughs> supplement. Thank you. Supplement. Everybody say supplement. 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 Just, you know y'all say that for me. <laughs> so I can remember. Supplement. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Supplement your income. Okay. Here we go. Um, LinkedIn. Who knows what LinkedIn is? LinkedIn is actually a business um, social media for business owners. So people in government. Are, so get your LinkedIn uh, account as well. Okay, um, here's the knowledge, here's something that they said, the bigger the list, the bigger the check. Everybody say that, the bigger the list, bigger the list, the bigger the check. Come on, let's say that together. The bigger the list, the bigger the check. Okay, number four, um, activity goals weekly. Now, now this is very, all this is still part of your networking biz goals. Um, how many calls are you going to make today? Notice I said today. <laughs> how many how many emails right how many emails are you going to send out today? Y'all discovered something in the back office of Momentous. Now somebody else may know, but I discovered. Oh my goodness! I was like, you can click on different types. I think it's under leads. So help me out. But you can click on. Um, a particular video in the back office and send it out as an email. Mm -hmm. And they can watch it and your face is actually on their email. I was like, what? <laughs> so here I am, mean, all this time, you know, it was actually a particular tool that I could use, but I wasn't using it. Go ahead. That also tells you how many times that person has viewed it. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Say that one more time. It'll tell you how many times that person's looked at it. Okay. So if they've looked at it once, if they've looked at it twice, mm -hmm. give them a call. Yeah. Okay. They might look at it twice more. Mm -hmm. So that's that's awesome. So it actually gives you how many times the person calls. Okay. I'm sorry. I was... Okay, what we, what is what 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 what, 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 <laughs> what video are we watching? The one on opportunity, the one on my business. I tell you what, we, that's a training session all in itself. Okay, <laughs> I'm sorry. Me. That's okay, but we'll because there's some I'm other sorry. people who have some questions. Like there's a lady who wants to know how to do EMS. And uh, okay, and they they were leaving, and I told them I said, did you know that there is a training in the back of you're in the back office. Y'all, you just have to you just have to spend some honestly, you're gonna have to spend some time with your million dollar business. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> that costs you two ninety nine. That costs you two ninety nine. You're right. You're right. Duh. And actually one ninety nine because you immediately get the hundred back. <laughs> so really spend some time in your back office. Okay? 
right. Um, okay, how many videos are you going to send out? How many sit downs are you going to have? Okay, just last night, you know, here's a strategy, you all. Here's a strategy. I had a sit down, okay, last night um, at Panera Bread. I had my laptop and I called the individual beforehand, actually called two of them, and I asked them to meet me there at the same time. Don't be afraid of meeting two or three people at the same time, as it say, kill two birds, birds. birds. three birds, one stone. <laughs> Try to kill three of them with one stone. All right, all right. <laughs> Sorry, birds. I don't mean, <laughs> no offense. <laughs> But y'all see what I'm saying? So when you book, because there are times that some people may call off and say, I can't make it, you know. So at, at least try to book maybe two or three people at the same time. And both of them sat down. And here's another thing. Both of those people, both of them say, you know, I like what I see, but I don't have the money. And you know, I told them, I said, well, that's okay. You know, it's, 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 the money's going to come. You know, so... The, the main idea, the main thing is planting the what? Seeds. Planting the seeds. Planting the seeds. There, you'll be surprised. Six months from now, somebody, what's that thing that, what's that thing you call? Mo, 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 what? Mo. Momentous. Are you still doing that thing? Mo money. How's it going, Paul? Well, you see my Lamborghini out here, don't you? Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. Paul, oh, sign me up. Okay, I'm okay, let's go. You see it, I heard it. All right, I'm a kitty. I'm gonna catch up with you, brother. <laughs> okay. So speak those things that be nice, other what? That's word. That's, that's what right. That's what that's right. I'm sorry. No, go ahead. Go ahead. That's what they're trying to bay drive. Oh, really? Wow. Okay. Now here's another thing. Um, private. I call them. I want. To, I call them private wealth receptions. Some people call them private business receptions. Private wealth um, reception is a private meeting in your home. Okay. How many of those are you going to plan this week? One. So make the plans. You know, I understand some situations people don't feel comfortable with having people at home. That's okay. Well, schedule sit down. And I'm one of those people, you know, my wife and I, we, we pretty, you know, private when it comes to bringing people in our home. So, Hey, I just schedule a sit down, and that's another way that you can. So there's, in other words, there's no excuse. Okay. Um, how many text campaigns will you send out? There was a, a when I say text campaign, that simply means on your phone you make up a particular um, message, and this is what I did actually yesterday. It was amazing because I would, I, it was amazing. I said. Um, I need to sit down and talk with you. And you know how you group your text messages? Mm -hmm. What's a good time? And I actually sent it out to like 10 people. I had three people to respond. One said, I'll call you later. The other one actually showed up at Panera Bread. You know, and then another one. Now, here's another thing. Another one said, um, what's that website again? <laughs> I gave it to him once. No. When can when's a good time we can sit down? Why do why do I say that? You know, somebody may say, Well, you're missing out on the opportunity. If they can't take the time to sit down with you one on one, then they probably not worth your time. I know that's hard, but you already gave it to them like three weeks ago. <laughs> and they still hadn't looked at the website. They lost energy never saves. I'm sleep, energy never sleeps. <laughs> you, you can tell I'm um, um, church man. <laughs> so, but anyway, so with that, um, use the power of all the tools that you have at your ready access. Okay, webinars. Webinars. We have um, uh, Deidre did a webinar. Uh, What's it? Conference call. I'm sorry. Conference call. We'll come back to that. Okay. <laughs> webinars. There are webinars that we do. And also, for some of you who don't know, who may have a Facebook account, um, there's webinars that I do that I schedule for people to join in and attend the webinars. So it's set for a specific time. And um, you can bring your guests to the, those webinars. And then at the end of it, it says, get back with the person 
who invited you. So make sure if you send a person to that webinar, make sure they get back in touch with you. Okay? All right. Conference call. Okay. Deidre did a conference call last night. She's doing them every week. So it's another um, avenue. You know, some people, here's the thing. We have so many tools, avenues, there's no reason, no, no excuses. Everybody say no excuses. No, no excuses. excuses. So we have no excuses. If, if your person, a person you sponsor came in the other week, I just can't get anybody in. Okay. Are you still trying? You still, this is not a thing where it's like Paul has said many, many often times. There's some work with it. But you know, there's some benefits with the work that you put in. All you got to do is put in your time. Everybody say, put in your time. Put in your time. Yeah. Okay, and so there's some other ways. Okay, number five. What, how, and what system of prospecting will I use? How, how will you prospect, and what system of prospecting will I use? So I've already talked about those systems, the systems from webinar, conference call, texting, um, private wealth receptions, uh, emails, videos, Facebook, blah, blah, blah. Okay, number six. We talked about this. Um, we've got to master the art of invitation. And that's including myself, too. Got to master. Now, take it, for instance, sometimes you will master the art of invitation no matter how good you've done with the invitation. They, they'll say, okay, I'll be there. But they won't show up. I'm going to be honest with you. There was three people that actually said, now one had a legitimate excuse, excuse that I invited. They said they had a death in the family. I said, cool, I'll catch you the next time around. And um, another one said they weren't able to make it. And that's good, they got back with But then there was two of them that said that, oh yeah, I'll be there. Yeah, I'll have so-and-so to bring me. Are they here? <laughs> no. But you know what? That's okay. Because guess what? I'll call them again, again, and again. Now here's a clue. Keep asking them until they say what? Don't come. No. Yes. no. no. Okay. Keep asking them. Keep asking them. If they didn't say no, keep asking them. Of course we want them to say yes. But the whole point I'm trying to make it is don't get turned off with rejections. That's right. Don't get turned off with unanswered phone calls. Here, here's another. Oh, you all, you got to hear this one. One of the people I called a month ago when I first got started, I called them twice and they didn't answer my, my phone call. <laughs> well, now here's what happened. Is that a clue? It was a guy. Well, it's, this is a good clue that I'm getting ready to say. Uh, it's a husband and wife. The wife actually reminded him a few days ago that I called. And they called me back. Now, in my mind, I was thinking, well, I guess they're not interested. I guess they really don't want to know about it. But the wife reminded the husband, say, remember you got to call John. And they called me. And that was one of my sit-downs last night. Okay. <laughs> so sometimes, again, we got to get rid of our, as we say, our stinking thinking. Mm -hmm. Because I, I think a lot of times this, we, we deal with a lot of warfare, even in our minds, even in our businesses. And if we don't keep positive, Oh, here's another thing. Write this down. And I know this is business goals, but you got to make this part of your business goal. Personal development. Personal development. Your, of course, my number one, when I say this, that doesn't mean that I don't use other forms of personal development, because I do. My number one personal development book is the Bible. Amen. So I use scripture every day on a daily basis to build myself up, to speak it in existence, okay? But there are other sources of personal development. The Millionaire Next Door, Think and Grow Rich. Robert Kiyosaki, who's the author of Rich Dad, Poor Dad. So those are some personal development books that you can read to help you along the way, okay? All right, then last thing, and I'm finished. Um, don't use the brief, a, a brief presentation on the phone as your invitation. I'm just as guilty as everybody. It's hard. It really is hard. Well, what is it? 
Well, if you don't tell me a little about it, I'm not going <laughs> to I mean, people are sometimes like that. They're like, well, I guess I better tell them a little something. And once you tell them, you mess it all up. Why? Because there's a system in place. And if you don't use the system, you'll mess it up. And guess what? Even if they came in, they'll do the same thing. But if you, people follow what you do. But say, for instance, if that person called me or um, they asked me, well, what is it? I say, well, that's why you need to come out and, and, and check it out. You got to see it. Write that down. You got to see it to understand it. You got to see it to understand it. Okay? And last but not least, what I'm going to do too is put on, I have, as some of y'all know, I have a marketing um, business. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to put it on the website on Bean Tips. You can write this down, beantips.com. And I'm going to put it under icon of under net, it's going to be called Networkers Toolbox. So anytime, and it's free. So anytime you want to know about specific tips and training, just go to, again, beantips, B-E-E-M-T-I-P-S dot com. And then <laughs> on that website, go to Networkers Toolbox. And I'll have all of these tips that we're talking about. Um, and we're not going to, tonight, we're not going to do the three-way call. I know we want to, but it's getting late, and I want to be conscious of your time. So you just have to come tomorrow, next week, <laughs> right? <laughs> next week. Is that him? Is that him? You're right with that next week. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's everybody. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> bring your guests. So anyway, thank you all, and that concludes the training. Thank you.